Come on now, why don't you join us? If we join, then what's in it for me? If you join us, I'll make you beta. Beta? But I'm an alpha already. Being a beta in a pack of 12 is better than being an alpha in a pack of 4. Come on now, what do you say? Mmm, alright. I'm in. But you better keep your word and I better actually be the beta. Don't worry, you will. Alright everyone, here's the plan. Myself, Ace, Jamie, Arthur, Flint, and Ryder are going to go straight into their pack and we're going to start attacking. While we're attacking, I need Mason, Bailey, and Misty to go and try to get Connor out. I know he's very injured and he's probably going to need a lot of help to get out. So you three, you're going to go in after we've made a distraction and you're going to go get him out. Now, once you three have gotten Connor out, I want you to stick around for a little bit if it's safe enough, and I want you to keep an eye on how we're doing in the fight, and if it looks like we're kind of struggling, you, need, you three need to come back to the pack, and you need to tell these guys right here. If we're struggling, Callboat and Lance, and the three of you are going to come back, and you're going to help us fight. Dad, I want to help. No, Morgan, you and McKinley have to stay. They want you, and any chance that they can get you, they'll take it. And if things go bad, they might try to take you too. I'm not risking that. Oh, please. They're not going to take me. Dusty, I would like to go help. No, Ashani, you must stay. If anything bad were to happen to me, if I were not to come back after this fight, our pack needs a leader. They need our alpha, and you will need to do that for me. Dusty... I I want to come help, but I I really hope that I won't be the only alpha after this. I I bet I won't. We are outnumber them already, so I think we'll be okay. You need to stay here and help Lupin and Arrow watch the pups, and I need you to help Digger if anybody has injuries. And I need you to make sure McKinley and Morgan stay here along with Aspen, Sunny, and Winter. You, you have a big responsibility here, just as big as if you were going to come out and fight. Okay, Dusty. I love you, Ashani. I will come back to you, my love. I promise. I love you too, Dusty. Please come back. I will, dear. I promise. I will be back very soon, Lupin. I love you. I love you too, Bailey. I love you, my pups. Dad, I will be back very soon. Bye, Daddy. Bye, Daddy. You're going to do amazing, Bailey. You're going to help get Connor back. I sure will. Daddy, I don't want you to go. Don't worry, Wilson. I'll be back, my son. I'll be back before you know it. You won't even know I was gone. Okay, our packs. Let's move out. What is happening? Uh, Connor! <gasps> Bailey! Mason! Misty! Oh my gosh, I'm so happy to see you guys. Please help me. Don't worry, we're gonna get you out of here, Connor. Follow us, now. Well, 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 look at what we got here. How dare you hurt Connor? You're a monster. You're trying to take him away from me again! I will not let you have him! Why don't you guys go in and help them? They're doing bad. That wasn't our mission. Our plan was to get you, see how they're doing, and then get out. We need to go tell the rest of the pack that they're not doing good. 
There's so many more wolves than there usually is. There's like another pack here or something. This isn't good. They need backup. Now, Connor, let's get you back. Hey, everybody. We got Connor. You got an awfully bad there wound, boy. Let me come take care of you. Oh, uh, th thank you. Connor, you're alive! Oh, McKinley, I'm so glad to see you. Guys, our pack is in trouble. They need backup now. We need all that we can get. There's like a whole other pack there. Cobo and Fang, we need you. You need to come. We're on it. Let's go. I'm going to go to Sister, watch the pack. You're in charge. Wait, Ashani! I'm going. Wait, M Morgan, you can't! Wait! They're already gone. Just let them go. McKinley, I need you to be on alert. We need to guard these pups. Yes, yes, tear him apart. All right, now back off. The three of you, back off. Let me finish him. No! Stupid mutt! They're running away! We won! They're retreating! Dusty, Dusty, please! <coughs> dusty, Dusty, please! Please! You promised! You promised you'd come back! <coughs> please! Somebody help! We have to take him back to Digger! Uh, uh, Shani, I think it's too late. <gasps> <gasps> dusty, Dusty, no, please, please. Dad, Dad, come on, we're all here. I love you, Dusty, please don't go. I love you both. <sighs> no, Dad, please. No! No! Jamie? Jamie? Jamie, please. Jamie? Jamie! Jamie, no! Jamie! No! Ace. <sighs> Excuse me, everyone. Ace cannot attend because he is not feeling well. He's not doing good. He can't get up. Thank you, Digger. We are gathered here today to share the memory of Jamie and Dusty. Their heroic bravery saved the lives of Connor and many other heroes today. They both died heroically, saving their pack, fighting for their pack and their family, 
for their true calling. Jamie was a wonderful packmate, a brother, a cousin, an uncle. He was amazing. He was one of the nicest and patient wolves I've ever met. He was the greatest defender we ever had. He was an amazing warrior, a great fighter, and an honorable wolf. We will miss him dearly, and his legacy will live through us. Dusty was the greatest alpha this pack has ever had. He was the first to establish our pack, and he died protecting us. He was a brave warrior, an amazing fighter, and a great father. He taught his pups well and raised them right. He will live through the blood of his pups. They will carry his legacy on. He will be missed dearly and we will all remember him. Ashani, do you have anything to say? <laughs> he promised he wouldn't go. He promised. He promised he'd come back. I miss him so much. It's okay, Mom. You don't have to talk. It's okay if it's too much for you. <laughs> I love him. I miss him. <laughs> Morgan McKinley, you should go check in on her. I will. Digger, what's wrong with Ace? His infection in his leg. It keeps getting worse every day. Is there anything you can do for it? I've been trying, Arthur. I, I've i tried everything that I can think of. I've given him every remedy. I've put every treatment on him, and it's not going away. It's only getting worse. It's starting to get into his lungs. He's coughing. That's a really bad sign. If the infection keeps getting worse and it gets to his lungs, he might suffocate. Well, in better terms, he might drown. Or if it gets into his bloodstream, it can attack his heart and he could die at any moment. He's not doing good. He seemed okay yesterday. He's really gone downhill fast. I know. I think we should all start saying our goodbyes. Oh no.